Rachelle, let's be honest. I know what it's like to be a celebrity. The other day in a Walgreens, this wonderful older lady came up to me and said, hey, aren't you that weather guy James Zahara? But the level of celebrity, the level of infamy and opinions on this year's dancing stars, Kate Goslin, Pam Anderson, and Aaron Andrews, is through the roof. Justified or just ridiculous? You be the judge. I'm sorry, what was that? They are no strangers to the tabloids, no strangers to the headlines, and it seems regardless of whether or not you watch the show, everyone's got an opinion on them. So we went backstage and behind the scenes to see what this season's stars and their partners are really like. A lot of beautiful thin people in this competition who don't really have a lot to shake, so I'm hoping to mix <laughs> things up a little bit. We really are close, we're all rooting for each other backstage. You've had a whirlwind the last few months, when, uh, when does life go back to normal? You know, you only get a certain number of breaths in life, this is something really special that I get to do, and I am taking advantage of every single breath of it. How's this all going to translate once the season gets going? I'll be a lot more flexible. My legs will be the strongest they've ever been. It should be fun. And a lot of fines because I'm going to have some new moves in the end zone. Pussycat doll Nicole Scherzinger says this has been a huge thrill. Thrill is definitely the word. It's, ex it's exciting because everybody, you have friends and family come out to support you and then you know people are watching and you just want to entertain and have a good time. The busiest award goes to gold medalist Evan Lysacek and his partner Anna who are splitting their time right now between the ballroom and an ice skating tour. It's all on the East Coast and every day is a different city and different venue for us to practice in so it's gonna, we like have to adjust a lot. <laughs> Erin Andrews and her partner Max score the nicest award, still having fun after a whole lot of stress. Confidence level now going into next week. Minus 49. <laughs> <laughs> it's a slippery slope, I think. I'm just not, yeah. And winning my award for bad rap, Kate Goslin. I love your accent. Who genuinely came off as caring and kind, not necessarily what's been portrayed by the tabloids. Do you look forward to things getting a little more back to normal? Um, you know what, my life never ever slows down, so I'm just enjoying dancing as part of my life right now and as part of my work, if you want to call it that. I'm honored to be here. I'm totally obsessed now, I'm totally addicted. That addiction only lasted another week as Kate and Tony would get the boot. Now speaking of getting the boot, I got it from Pam Anderson, who wouldn't do an on-air interview unless we had different lighting. She looked great in person, but that's what it must really be like to see the world through some rose-colored sunglasses.